Hi guys and welcome back to Black Stag Styling and AW Smart Repairs. I say welcome back if you haven't checked out any of our videos before, please do. Check them out on the channel, loads of styling, loads of other VW Amarox, uh, bits and pieces like that with the pickup trucks that we've done before. But in this video we have another VW Amarok. Uh, this is a V6 one on a 17 reg and we are changing all the chrome to black. So we have the sidebars and the rear bumper. Uh, the chrome sections of them are going to be removed. They'll be uh, blasted and then powder coated in the black, uh, give an extra, extra bit of strength to the finish uh, because of stone chips. Then we've got the under sections of the mirrors, the front sections that are chrome and the rear badges that are all being done in black as well and they'll be fitted back onto the vehicle. We've got the alloy wheels, they're going into black as well, so uh, basically everything being turned to black. Tyres refitted and rebalanced. Um, we've got the front uh, V6 and re uh, front V6 badge being done in red, just to add a little bit of extra colour to it. Um, and then everything back together. So stay tuned for this one. Um, it should be a good video. Everyone loves the Amarox. Uh, thanks again for checking out the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and turn on the old notifications uh, so you can stay fully up to date with everything we're doing. We will crack on and get this one into the workshop, start stripping all the parts. Thank you very much. Roll the intro. One, two, three. Here we go, Swad's now taking the uh, near side side step off. Or oh. side bar, really, isn't it, mate? Side bar, yeah. We go with bar, shall we? Should we finish this stuff, Dave? Of course, wobbly. Only a good sign, isn't it? Certainly is, mate, certainly is. Also got this uh, nice defender in for doing some wax oil and raptor treatment. So Rob's now in the process of just cleaning the underbody, isn't he Rob? Yep, nice and dirty. <laughs> but it will nice and clean then we'll be uh, prepping underneath and wax oiling the underbody in a black wax oil. But the rear section, so the rear cross member, toe in section and inner step will be done in black raptor. Here we go, so rear bumper now coming off. Oh, look at that. It's a bit grubby. It's just the mud holding it in, isn't it? Oh, it's frame, is it? Yeah, there's a little bit, yeah, little bit yeah. of mud on there, look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now it's time to get the front bumper off. Get all them chrome bits off. Right, so the next bit will be stripping all the bits off the rear bumper, so that's the parking sensors. So we've got to remove them, they are stuck on with some plates. Time to get them off, give the bumpers a clean as well, and then same on the front bumper to remove all the chrome bits. We'll be strip all the other bits off as well. Right, we're going to go and see how Ad is getting on as he has uh, started stripping all the parts, or all the rest of the parts off the Amarok, so we're going to go and see how he's getting on with this. Here we go. He's around there somewhere. <gasps> He's a gone. He was here a moment ago. <gasps> there he is, look. We well, knew he was here somewhere. I think he's playing games with me. Stop messing about the, that bloke don't like it on YouTube, does he? <laughs> no. That's messing about having fun. Yeah, we, we, we have had somebody complain that we have a little bit too much fun and act like um, fools. So uh, we do apologise, but we are just trying to keep the videos a little bit of fun, just, we, just, mate? Just trying to have, fun trying to have work, a little bit know? of fun, you know? If, if it, you know? if it's not doing it for you, Country Files on on a Sunday evening. <laughs> half past seven, I believe it starts. That's it. If that's more to your liking, I know yeah. what you mean. Yeah. You can't keep everybody happy, can you? We, we do. We try, but no, we you're try, right. But, yeah. We can't. 
Right, we're just going to get the parts prepped, the chrome parts all prepped for the uh, black paint. Emily Fraser? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. <laughs> oh, 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 well done, pal. Rob's on the case as well, getting them all prepped. Yep. There's a few bits already. The badges. Just in the bottom sections for the mirrors. And then they'll be all ready, get a bit of primer on. Right, so we've now got the bits for the Amarok into the, or the first lot of bits into the booth for the Amarok. So this is some of the badges. Fraser has already put down some of the etch primer onto these pit, these parts. So it's now a case of uh, getting some color down onto them and Fraser will be getting them lacquered as well. Just thought we give you a little view of them. There we go, it's the old VW badges. And then over to the text over here. So doing the same with that as well. Uh, we've removed to start with the uh, badges which were in chrome at the start with painted in lovely satin matte kind of black. Let's have a little look, shall we? Look. Looking rather nice, isn't they? Yeah. Lovely, isn't they? And also, don't forget the, uh, oh, look at that. Yeah, the VW badge. Right. Cool, look, looking good. Yeah. Uh, right, so I've machine polished this all up just to get rid of any bits that have faded from where they were previously. Yeah. Uh, taped up, measured where they go. And we're ready to slap them back on. <laughs> oh, ready oh, to put your double sided tape back uh, on the back yeah. of them, look. Oh, every single one. Do you want to have a look? Every single every letter. Every single letter's <laughs> got a sticky back. back well done, back. Pal, well done. Yeah, it takes yeah, a little while, you know. We, we, got, we got you, off. we got you. And the new one. We're ready to get, his, get the V Derby badge back on. They like these when you get them straight, these old customers. They do, don't they? A bit picky like it that. It has got some special uh, pins. Yeah, help line Straight it up. Here. here we go. Superb. Right, here we go, so Ad's just getting that last sticker on, that's the four motion one. Just sits underneath the TDI badge. Yeah. Get him lining that up. Oh, make sure it all looks good. Straight up. Definitely, mate, definitely. Superb, look at that. VW badge as well. And then the Amarok badge as well, looking smart. Mm. All black. Here we go, time to get the old grill on the front. It's all finished. <laughs> Bar, you know it. Looking good, isn't it? Looking good, all in the matte black. Lovely, With the matte red V6 badge. Looking rather smart, that, rather smart. Got the little bits for the fog lights done as well, in the black. Now we get it all lined up and fitted back on. Uh, I've, got it a bit, I've got it a bit high. I think uh, now's that time to put the link above your head to some of our other pickup styling videos, oh, yeah? Yeah, it is, yeah? There it is, mate, yeah, just there. Is. Yeah, you'll see it. You'll see, see it, it to mate. believe it. Oh, can you hear that with a click? Positive click, that. Sort of click wheel. Oh. <laughs> That's what we're after. Why not Rob? Why not Rob? Thanks for your help, Rob. Cheers, <laughs> <laughs> mate. Right, so we now have the sidebars and rear bumper all powder coated. There we go, we do this, the powder coating, particularly on these items, 
because they do, when the vehicles are fitted with the all-terrain tyres, they do fling a few stones up, don't they, Ed? They, oh, they pick a bit of bit stuff up, don't they? They do, they yeah. do, pal. So powder coating them just uh, gives them that extra protection. Yeah. And we all like a bit of extra protection, yeah, well, you, don't we, Ed? You've got to have a bit of extra protection, haven't you? That's right. You'd be daft not to. But here we go then. Oh, really, Rob over here, look, he's, he's going to look good on his face. Oh, Rob. <laughs> oh, oh, really, oh, he's... Really hurt, Robert. You take my man's eye right out, haven't you? You just took my man's head clean off there, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> uh, luckily, Adam is still uh, able to fit these sidebars. Don't know. Well, one eye. I, I, I haven't tried yet. <laughs> That's true. Oh. Why don't you stop throwing <laughs> stuff at me? <laughs> Bunch of kids, aren't they, Alex? Oh, mate, yeah, luckily we're here to... Uh, to uh, control them. There we go, so Ed's now lining that up, get that back on the vehicle. Trying to, <laughs> Got a nice motorbike in here as well, haven't we, Rob? Rob liked the old motorbike. Look at that nice BMW S1000 RR. RR. <laughs> <laughs> Well, there we go guys. Thanks for checking out another one of our videos here at Black Stag Styling. So as you've seen, we have now finished the uh, VW Amarok. Um, done quite a few bits and pieces to this one. So uh, we do we love working with the pickups, as you know. Um, so we've changed uh, all the chrome bits to black. So that's the bits on the front grille, uh, the little slats, uh, moving across to the wing mirrors, the undersides of the wing mirrors um, have all been removed and then prepped and done in, uh, in a satin black. We've also done the side bars and the rear bumper. So they've all been stripped, but we've had them powder coated. So powder coating, just because them areas are more prone to the stones hitting them, uh, we've had them powder coated, gives them an extra bit more strength. Um, we've also done the alloy wheels, so they've been off fully chemically stripped and then done in satin black as well. We've done the V6 badge on the front in uh, satin red, uh, so it just adds a nice little touch to that. And then, of course, the rear badge has all been removed and done in the satin black as well, including the VW badges front and rear. So if there's anything like this we can help you with here at Black Stag Styling and AW Smart Repairs, do please give us a shout. Check out some of our other social media things as well, like Instagram, uh, Facebook, and, of course, TikTok, uh, all found by just searching for Black Stag Styling. Um, again, as always, please do like and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notifications, that way you stay fully up to date with everything we're doing as we have some really cool stuff uh, coming up on the channel. And uh, we will catch you again soon. Stay safe and we will uh, hopefully see you for some more videos. Thanks very much.